and we are about oh and top it with some hot sauce i mean with some uh salsa baby listen yeah chipotle would never hire me at this point but i know this soup is about to be so delicious here's what i eat in a day Good morning, beautiful people, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Shakela. I create and share delicious plant-based recipes. If you're returning, thank you so much for being here. I really do appreciate that. This week's video is a what I eat in a day. So I hope you enjoy it. We're gonna go through breakfast, lunch, dinner, maybe a few snacks in between, all that good stuff. So without further ado, let's get into the video. All right, so, hi buddy. All right, so for breakfast, and I'm talking to my dog, if <laughs> y'all are probably like, who is this girl talking to? My dog is down here. <laughs> Say hi, buddy. Hi. Give me five. Oh, Say hi, Sherry Worry. But for breakfast this morning, I am, sorry, I'm trying to get this set up. But for breakfast this morning, I'm just gonna make a quick breakfast hash, have some sweet potatoes, I have some tofu, kale, I don't have any onion, which is kind of disappointing. I think I have some tomatoes in there. I'm just gonna kind of like piece stuff together. Breakfast hashes are like so easy. It's kind of just like a dump of a bunch of stuff. So that's what I'm gonna make for breakfast today. It's gonna be quick, easy. I'm gonna throw my sweet potatoes in the air fryer. And we are about, oh, and top it with some hot sauce. I mean, with some uh, salsa. Baby, listen, we're about to eat good. It's gonna be quick, easy, so let's go. So I have just about every appliance going off in this kitchen. I got the air fryer on, I got the dishwasher. So hopefully it's not too loud, but, so with my breakfast hash, I'm going to, I purchased these Jack and Annie's, their vegan savory breakfast sausage, actually made from jackfruit. Um, let's see what other, other ingredients. Yeah, jackfruit, water, soy flour, canola and soybean oil, coconut oil, some spices, brown sugar, fruit and vegetable juice so it does contain soy um, but these are actually pretty good we do get five grams of per protein per patty um, the only thing is so it is 13 well 300 milligrams of sodium in one they're pretty good um, I think I do still like the Beyond Meat breakfast sausages a bit more but I like the ingredients and the nutritional facts on this one a little bit more so I guess it's like they taste good, but they don't taste as good as the Beyond ones. So I hope that helps. But I've had it like a few days and it's not bad. It's not bad. bought some pre-cut onions and found them in here. Garlic powder. Was that? No, that's onion powder. Have some garlic powder right here. Some paprika. So what happened last time? Do that. <laughs> and I think I've shared before, but I always use extra firm tofu. But the difference is I always freeze my extra firm tofu. So it looks much differently than if you just buy it straight from the grocery store. And I'm holding it because I have tofu in my hand and it's like dripping. But this is extra firm tofu. Back up some extra firm tofu but it's like super squishy because I just took it out the package so if you do and I just I'm just saying this so like if you do end up buying extra firm tofu and you want to cook it like I typically cook it I always freeze my tofu before I cook with it 
or it'll be like squishy like this, which you don't want, typically. I don't, you do you. But <laughs> all my recipes, I always freeze my firm, I mean, I always freeze the extra firm tofu, then I thaw it out, drain it, and cook it. Whereas this one, I just took it out the pack, so it's completely different. So this is the black salt, so it gives food like an eggy flavor. Um, I'm gonna add that at the end, but for now, I'm gonna add this turmeric. I've been using this a lot lately. It's the Dash Table Blend. Just another layer of flavor. Okay, it's looking good. It's looking real good. Yeah. This looks really good. I need to add some more seasoning to it. But other than that, okay. Let's get down some. Add it in my tomatoes. So now I'm about to add in some of that, hopefully you can tell. It's the black salt, again, helps give food an eggy flavor. But I like to do it at the end so it doesn't cook down and the flavor is like right there. Y'all, this smells just like eggs. Like, just like eggs. It's, it's crazy. Um, but I think I've shared this before. It is native to the Indian culture. They use it in a lot of cuisines. All right, got my kale. This looks really good. I'm very happy about it. I'm gonna save the other half for breakfast tomorrow. I have my cooked uh, sweet potatoes. All right, add those in there. And that was only, again, like one fourth, or maybe like one third of a sweet potato. And then last but not least, I have my breakfast sausage. All right, so I'm gonna add a little bit of sriracha on here. Not a whole bunch, cause your girl cannot do spicy. And I think that's all I wanna do. This looks delicious. I cannot wait to dig in. Again, I have my tofu scramble, which is loaded with vegetables, some air fried sweet potato, and a vegan breakfast sausage. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I always say that, but this is so good. A lot of fiber, a lot of protein. Y'all, I am such a child. I gotta break my food up before I eat it. <laughs> All right, y'all, so now it is time for lunch. I'm about to make a quick burrito. I have a vegan chicken patty, like the, um, what's the brand? Boca, Boca. I have the Boca brand of like their, I think it's either the Buffalo or just like the regular one. I'm air frying that. I'm gonna add it to my burrito. I just realized I forgot to put my um my peppers and onions on here. Hold on, hold on. You gotta have the peppers and onions, and I did taste a little bit of this. I need to sprinkle some seasoning on this, okay? This onion and herb dash seasoning, and just a little bit of salt. All right, so now we get to roll it back up. Roll that bad boy up. My hands are a mess. Yeah, Chipotle would never hire me at this point. They'd be like, girl, you are tearing up all the customers' food. Um, okay, we're gonna make that work. Hold that down like that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, let's see. I'm just gonna lift up one side. Ooh, it looks good! Oh, I'm so happy! It looks really delicious. 
y'all chipotle hired me because your girl did that i did that all right it's time to eat oh this about to be so good mm -hmm. all right we have end of the day vibes y'all my contacts finally came in so i can see with my glasses now um but i'm about to make dinner it is time to cook something comforting something warming and if y'all can recall <laughs> remember that one time i have bought these beans <laughs> and i was so mad because i thought that they were be i mean i thought that they were chickpeas and they ended up being great northern beans I'm finally going to cook with them and I'm going to add them to a soup. So that is what we're making for dinner tonight. Y'all better not be talking about my nails either. <laughs> I know I need to fill them in. It's okay, I need to fill them in. But I know this soup is about to be so delicious. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is, it's so good. Sorry, I got really excited. <laughs> place this is so delicious i just have some sourdough bread that i'm going to dip in this i'm trying to get some on there mm. this is yeah this is it's so good this is amazing i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so so much for watching i really do appreciate it be sure to leave a comment and let me know what you're planning to try mm -hmm. okay Thank y'all for watching. I appreciate it. I hope you guys have a great night. I hope you enjoyed this video or day, night for me, day for y'all. Thank you so much for watching. I can't stop eating it. It's so good. Mm -hmm. This is amazing, y'all. So good.